Ooh, look at all that golden goo. You know what that is? Yep. That is a ringing up a solid 34. It is. It's actually how it was. It is. I don't know what that says. 2001 Mattel. Mattel? Mattel make Hot Wheels now? You know, I like the 70 Chevelles, the Camaros. I don't know why. They gotta make everything look so freaking futuristic, weird. But that's just my opinion. And um, I don't care about yours. <laughs> Finally, the first for today. Let's see what we got here. Feels like a six. Which is the per it's a six. The perfect weight. Running in actually at a 26.2. Just perfectly. Barely even covered. That's why you gotta dig along the embankments here. Hey, I'm by the river. Guess what I found? <laughs> well, a weight. Yeah, it's a six, too. I'll take these all day long. Even if you guys don't want to see them, I'll take sixes all day long. Another one of those odd round ones like that. Cool. Another six. Happy. Happy AF. Right on the surface. Looks like we got some uh, hippie jewelry. Yeah, it's a hoop earring. Bunch of little beads. Kind of cool, I guess. Well, better than finding pennies. At the racetrack, and I mean, at the racetrack. Anyway, I hate to say, except for a little over a dollar so far, that's my best find. And that looks homemade and probably not worth a dollar but it's something I'll take it underneath the bleachers oh, I'm gonna make sure these get back to Eldon these are obviously for a child um, protect their ears from all the motorcycles going by dinosaurs and stuff yeah this is for a child I'm gonna make sure they get back to uh, and they were right underneath there but yeah you do the right thing I'm proud to see that uh, parents actually uh, make their children wear ear protection out here. That's cool. So I'm going to get back, that back to the president of the motorcycle club, my buddy Eldon. That's it. Kind of an interesting uh, find. Okay, folks. I'm at the racetrack, obviously. Um, I didn't film nothing today. Got a, you know, a couple bucks and change. But I did pull this tractor, right? This red tractor. Yeah, it's missing its wheels. Still dirty. Well, there's one wheel. It's still attached. Anyway, the man who gave me full permission to be here at the racetrack is over there on his red tractor. The owner is over there on his tractor. Come on, focus, focus, focus. Well, that's not focusing. Anyway, Eldon's over there the owner of the Mount St. Helens Motorcycle Club. Nice guy who gave me full permission to come here and um, hunt daily. Otherwise, I'd be bored as hell. I'd be over at that park where it's modern and I can't find nothing. So what I'm going to do is I always told them if I ever found anything that meant anything to the track, I'd give it to them. I don't know if he's going to think I'm going to give him something really cool, but... He's over there on his red tractor. I just dug this one up. Okay, let's go meet Elton if he wants to be on anyway. camera. That is. Okay, we're live here. I just showed you uh, Elton was rolling up on the tractor, that MF, and that's Macy Ferguson to you guys. Don't overthink it, <laughs> all you city boys. Um, anyway, Elton, I told you if I ever found that anything that was like, you know, substantial possibly to the track that I would give it to you. Well, and you were, you were just cleaning some wheels? <laughs> well, that's a little. Back to you. 
Yeah. That means the tire, the yeah. tire fixed on it, and the other tire. It's got one on there. It's got one. Get that cute. Well, we're just gonna put that right on the deck of that tractor there, and okay. And uh, if I ever need a, I've got a small job. This is the guy to do it. <laughs> that is okay. <laughs> Eldon, uh, I thank you again for the permission. Uh, hey, hey, you guys, show some love down below in the comments. Absolutely. You thank Eldon for uh, allowing me to uh, have this permission. Otherwise, there wouldn't be too many videos. Now, would there? Show the man some love. Give some comments down below. I got a tractor. Yeah. Anything you want to say to the people? Good. You're good? It, yeah. Okay. Have a good one. See you tomorrow. Yeah, so I get this perfect 1011, right? It's ringing up and I keep digging this hole right down here. And I find what appears to be a piece of watch, man. Obviously, a death by lawnmower. But I'm still getting this 1011, so I keep digging. You know, I'm getting excited because it's like a mid low tone. And we've all been fooled by, you know, that, uh, ketchup packet but I didn't find one ketchup packet down here what I found <laughs> was like seven taco sauce well at one point I was getting like a solid 21 now it's a little bit higher I'm gonna go ahead and dig this I'll bring you right back to it Okay, when I had a solid 21, and then it started like uh, creeping into like crazy numbers, that's piece of can slaw, but there's still more there and I'll keep digging, but my solid 21, like a bling, don't trash Nevada. It's got the state of Nevada there. Huh. Okay. That is my solid 21. Thinking it was like a penny, but I found a piece of a, uh, you know, you saw it, can slaw. And there's something else there. I'll bring you back in if it's anything good. You know, people are always bragging about that new, how fast that 5G service is. Well, I got something for you folks. Today's video is coming in 7G high definition. I got 7G. Thought it was an ordinary penny. Just, I mean, barely below the surface. It's like a, it's a butterfly, obviously. A little dirty, but kind of shiny. Oh, hold on, right there, ah, 21, like I said, I thought it was a penny, I bet that's not real, I bet it's bling, just barely into the surface, I don't know what that is, I mean, that's not like earring crap, it's like crap I fish with, I don't know, maybe someone is wearing it as a pendant, I don't know, it's good looking, but... Um, no, I'm going to go with copper, silver over. I saw that. It's got, eh, I don't, that doesn't have silver weight. I'm going to call it bling, but you, actually that's good looking piece of bling. Yeah, good looking piece of bling. Good enough. Okay, interesting enough, I don't show a lot of coins, but I found a nickel right here. So I ran my coil up here. Before I popped the plug, it was, there it is, about 2931. Unless I hallucinated coins. I did not. There they are. I want to watch as I pull them out. I don't think anything's silver, but look at look at the colors, the way they laid together. That one on top of that penny. That green to that quarter. That green, that's a state quarter, obviously, to that quarter. And that quarter to that penny. So it's a, uh, yeah. Not nothing crazy amazing, but I, I just like the colors. 
and they've been stacked there for a few years. That's actually a nickel. So you got 55, 57 cents, and there might be more in there. If there's anything more, I'll bring you right back in. Ranging in at almost a 16. At about, I'm actually gonna pull this down. Just about six or maybe just under six inches. Hell yeah, my favorite things to pull up are nickels, but not just any nickel. This is, what is it, San Francisco? I'm not sure which year, but with the big old, uh, I think that's S for San Francisco. I'll let you know the year, but yeah, a war nick. I love finding these. These are like my favorite I mean, seriously, some of my favorite coins to actually find because of how few of years they were minted. But it is right there, big old S. Big old S. Warnick, pretty cool. Huh. 2930, thought it was just gonna be a, another quarter. But that is a Mustang GT. I don't know which brand it is. It's only eh, probably like a couple inches down. Like third car that I found this week. I can't read it. My eyes aren't that good. I don't know. I'll show you. Look at that. Wheel spin. You're like, okay, yeah, it's another Hot Wheels. How often do you find them with the wheel spin? A little bit of dirt inside, but um. No, I probably won't clean it up, but yeah. Look at that, all four wheels though. I never find Hot Wheels, or whatever this toy is. Or all wheel spin, especially two inches down. Cool enough. Sit, you sit, you listen. Auto. We rolling? I am at the, what do we call this place down here? Um, Gearheart Garden, dog park. About three and a half years old. Look at that, look at that pretty face. I wanted to put him on film. Look at that beautiful dog. You know I love shepherds though. And okay. we're gone. <laughs> beautiful. Ringing in at a solid 24 at the dog park. Look around. Ooh, look at all that golden goo. You know what that is? Yep. That is a vape, uh, but that ain't your typical vape. I mean, here in Washington where marijuana is legal, look at all of that goo. That is a, what do they call it? A dab pipe, a oil pipe. I don't, it's perfectly legal, so um, I understand that. Ring it at 24, 24 to about 27, but that is, I don't know if that, that gel is coming up. Um, I know, not because I smoke, but that is a marijuana vape pipe. What, what brand is that? Look at that, USB. I'm gonna guess that's kind of expensive, and I know that little tube right up there is like really expensive. I don't care, I don't smoke crap, but I don't condemn those who do. And this is actually like beautiful, since I didn't find no gold this weekend. Uh, there's your gold. That's probably like absolutely the most expensive thing that I have found this week USB um, what do you call that oil um, dab oil 701 um, I don't know I don't want to keep ranting on this I know someone that that's gonna go to and they'll be happy with it <laughs> good enough 